Welcome on our solar system. Uh, from time to time, we want to share our uh, desktop with the world on Google Plus. It's uh, a custom to put on Friday our desktop. And with this little tool here, the screenshot launch screenshot, you can grab the whole screen, a window, an area, and so on. But if we take a screenshot, you will see that it will be in G. Now, which is fine if you post it on Google Plus and so on, but I do need some screenshots as well for my website. So PNG is too big, it's two megabytes or so, a screen this size. So I want it to save in GPG, that would be great, otherwise I have to open it again and save as GPG, which is just fine. But there is another way. You can't say the system, tell the system here to save in some way. There's no preferences available, but there is a way to do it. I'll show you how. We installed the program deconf or deconf editor in one of our previous uh, movies. It's all on GitHub Eric Dubois Solus, Ultimate Solus. And there you have this little program. You can look for it, sudo deopkg uh, and then deconf editor. What we'll do is open up, and I've just went and, and looked already, so you see already the result. So what you do is you go up to the first of the, the row, the first row here, and then press the thing you're looking for. I was looking for PNG. Where are all the settings regarding PNG? And it was already the second hit. So we are at the GNOME screenshot. That's the little program that's down here. Default file type says PNG. I'm going to open it. I'm going to change the use default value. And I'm going to say, no, next time around, you'll be using a GPG. Apply it. That's that. Let's take another screenshot and see what happens. And there you go, you have now a GPG extension and the images will be much smaller, but in the end it will still be a beautiful picture.